All right, Shane, a big win for the team back in the win column tonight. Wasn't a whole lot of offense. Uh, how much harder do you need to work on a night like that? Uh, it's just mainly just staying focused and uh, you know, not trying to overdo it, do things when uh, it finally does come to you. I feel like in a slow game, you feel like you need to you know, do a little extra when you do get that work, but just keeping it simple. And I thought you know, the team was doing that, I was doing that, and it led to you know, a great night for us. Yeah, a lot of times for goaltenders, if it's a little bit of a slower night, obviously you're not able to get into a rhythm, but they had a couple of good chances, and I thought you were able to come out and stand on your head. Uh, what would you see through some of those plays? Yeah, like I said, uh, it was just kind of same focus. You know, obviously no team's going to go a whole game without any scoring chances, so you know they're going to come, and you know, was kind of you know spotty at times from their offense, but I thought you know, we did a good job in eliminating them and giving them kind of one chance and done. And then uh, going back down there, and so you know, I'm glad I could you know, help the team get a win, and I'm glad that you know, they made my night pretty easy. Yeah, kind of a fluky play I want to ask you about. The puck rimmed in, it hit the, the door on the glass and kicked right out in front of you. You had to quickly react. Oh, what's running through your head as you see that kind of just pop out in front? Uh, I've seen that happen a few times kind of in practice and warm-ups. You know, I've, I've seen that door. That's why I didn't go back behind the net. And, uh, you know, I saw it hit. I heard it hit it, and I looked, and uh, it started coming back out the middle, and I tried getting, uh, I think it was Muck, out front his attention as it was coming off. But, uh, you know, no harm, no foul at the end of the day, so it was nice. Yeah, how big of your game is communication? Even at the end of the game, you know, they pull the goalie and they send it in. I saw you communicating with Calvis to clear the puck out. How big is that for a goaltender? Yeah, that's huge, especially, you know, in moments like that when, uh, you know, they're pushing to try and get anything generating, and, you know, I can go back there and help the DO, and we can you know, just get pucks out as fast as they can get them in, really. And, uh, you know, that one at the end of the play, you know, I saw I had time and was telling Teddy, you know, to hustle back and be an option for me. And then, uh, you know, we just got the puck out. We, we were breaking out real nice tonight, and we uh, did it all the way through the end of the game. I thought entirely on the defensive side of things and the defensive zone, communication was great tonight, and you guys really worked together as a unit. Between your pipes, uh, what would you see on that defensive end? Yeah, I, I thought uh, we were... You know, end in place fast. We were getting on to pucks and not really giving them a chance to get set up in the offensive zone mostly. I think that was the biggest part and I thought our breakouts were clean. So we were getting the pucks quick and then we were breaking out clean against them and I thought that was a big part of the uh, D zone was kind of eliminating the fact that we need to play D zone. <laughs> Now looking ahead, you get the Iowa Heartlanders again on Friday. You get them three of the next four as a goaltender. What's it like seeing that same team? You kind of learn their tendencies a little bit. Maybe it helps out. Yeah, a little bit, but you know, every team's going to make adjustments, so they might tweak something here and there. It'll be nice to go back and see kind of what their tendencies are, what they like to do, especially on the uh, on their power play. And they got one tonight, so you know that's something to look at and uh, you know make note of. But, you know, they're, well, obviously they're going to make some changes from here to Friday, and, uh, you know, we'll do the same as well. Looking forward to a couple more matchups with the Heartlanders. Yeah. I had great win, Shane. Yeah, thank you.